The June plenary session ended on Wednesday night at the Yaoundé Congress Hall. A total of seven bills were scrutinized during the second session of the National Assembly and four separate special plenary sessions were organized in which some lapses in the functioning of some public and private corporations were discussed, among other things. The discussion relative to the, the budget, the orientation of budget. They sent the document very late and we didn't have time to discuss deeply, to analyze deeply and to discuss uh, uh, deeply in this document. Because we here, we are parliamentarians sent here to represent our population. So when we discuss about budget, we want government to take in consideration the will of those who have voted for us. And we didn't have time to eat. And this is my disappointment. During his closing speech, the Speaker of the National Assembly, Honorable Kabaye Igejibriu, called for a joint action to fight against the COVID-19 pandemic in the country, a point welcomed by some parliamentarians. We advising our brothers and sisters to take the vaccine. It's better to, be, to take the preventive uh, learn rather than waiting to cure yourself later. So, you know, we talked about, so much about getting to know who is the person who is uh, administering the drug and what drug you are taking generally in life. It's very important. House Speaker Kavaye Gejibru also praised government's efforts so far in the fight to contain the COVID-19, especially with the approach of the African Cup of Nations tournament. Medals of recognition were handed to seven members of parliament, including Honorable Joshua Osi of the Social Democratic Front Party, for their duties to the state.